Martin Dan here from the Diamond Minecart and welcome to uh, the Diamond Dimensions mod pack, modded survival, where last time, um, I've been busy since last time, very, very busy. I've got this walrus on my head and I'm feeling good. So I've been mega, mega busy. These hands have been working very, very hard, grafting away at making the brand new house, which I promised would happen last time. It now has a roof, it now has two floors, actually... Technically, it has three floors, which is awesome. So it's not finished to the point that the enchanting room is done because I want to do that in a separate episode with different stuff. But um, I've literally taken it apart and started again. But you can, you'll be able to see why it took so long. And also, you can see my sword here on the bottom left has done a lot of work since last time. And that is because lots of things attacked me. This right here, this TNT came from a guy called a TNT. It was, no, it was called a, a bomb carrier. And that guy was throwing bombs everywhere, and I'll show you what happened. Actually, let me sleep first. Probably the best idea. Um, I'll show you the hole that he created. I, just, I was just building away, and then it was, like, exploding. And I don't even know where it was coming from. And then, oh, no. Oh, God. There's things out here. Go away. Go away. You can see the new house. I wanted to surprise you. But anyway, guys, here's the new house. What is that? Oh, dude, what is that? Um, oh, there's a... Hey, zombie. How you doing, buddy? Get out of here, you punk. Go away. Go away. Oh, jeez. What is going on here? What are these? Dark beasts? This is unfair. This is severely unfair. Go away. Please go away. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. You can see how much stuff spawns out here. I've never seen one of you before. What are you, dark beast? Get out of here. What is that? What did you give me? You gave me moon dust. Oh, that's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Oh, I'm running out of food as well. I don't know if I've got any because I've been using so much while I've been building. Oh, this has ruined the whole surprise. Thank you, Dark Beasts. Good job, buddy. Good job. You're the best. You're actually the best. Right there, Moon Dust. You can use that for a lot of stuff, can't you? Yeah, we've got lots of stuff that we can use that for. Um, wow. Have I... Oh, I do have some food on me. Nice. I thought I ate it all. Or eaten it all. Is that is that the best way to say it? But anyway, I decided to scrap the idea of using these right here, which is why I've got them. It's like a... Are these wedge slopes? I didn't think they, they, they were, but um, anyway, I must have built the wrong ones. But um, yeah, this is the house, guys. Yeah, yeah, the house. So I like it, actually. Looking at it again and coming back, I actually quite like it. There's a few more things I need to do, like the outside. I want to put uh, a little stone path and finish off this part here. Um, I think I have some bones around somewhere. Uh... Uh, yes, yes I do. So um, let's quickly bone mill that and see if we can get another set of flowers on the other side. Um, let's see. Grass. Grass. What is going on? Please tell me you heard that. Is that the sound of bone meal? Or is that just like some crazy beast? Um... Oh no. Um... Oh, why?! <laughs> is that because I've used slabs on the floor? Oh, are you kidding me? Guys, why are you in here? You're not allowed in here. This is my house, and you're standing way too close to the fire. They really just spawned in here? I think it's because I used slabs at the top, so there's like a... Oh, I don't even know. Right, then let's just deal with this, and we'll deal with that. Oh, my goodness. I can't be... Oh! What are you? Go away. Go away. I hate you guys. You green, green bats there. There we go. Oh my goodness. This is so bad. I built my house in completely the wrong location. Oh, there's another flower there. I want a red one, really. Ugh. Ugh. You know what? I'm going to have to go and find a red one and plant it down there. That's fine. Um, what are we going to do now? Um, hey guys, you need to get out of here, you punks. Look, they can't even move. They're like in perfect... Oh, they can move. <laughs> oh, that was close. Oh, geez. So, um, yeah, they can spawn in here. That's bad. Let's put up some torches because I haven't done that yet. Some torches there and there. And welcome to the inside of the new house. So let me just go outside. I haven't decided what to do with the door. I kind of like it how it is. But, um, yeah, welcome to the new house. It's beautiful. It's ready to go. And it's got a lot of space. So the previous house didn't really have much space. And we've got more space through there when we make that room properly. Um, we've got all of this, which is cool. Um, hopefully that is the torches are going to sort out that problem. But um, let's put a couple more down just in case. Um, wow, I didn't think that was going to happen. Ladders. Um, I want to change these for carpenters' ladders. Um, the same ones that are in the other house. But for now, we've got this second floor up here, which has a huge window over here. So we can see what's going on. What nasties are going to attack us when we leave our door. And I just love having big windows in Minecraft, especially when you've got, like, this view. Just windows everywhere look amazing. Got windows out here, so you can see the left-hand side. Um, this will probably be a bit of roof above, so I might even, like, crack this open and put a little bit of an archway here. Similar to what I've done here, and this is the other side, so you've got a nice little balcony here. You can actually jump off here, but I wouldn't advise that. That is a terrible idea. And there we go. 
that is pretty much it. So I should probably put a couple of torches on here. Otherwise, things are going to spawn on my balcony and then come inside my house. So let's finish off um, this bit as well. And then we've also got a rooftop because I started using um, these, these carpenter's blocks, and I just did not like them. They looked very, very strange. They didn't look Minecrafty at all. I think that was the problem. Whoa, that hit me far. Come here, you punk. There we go. Get out of here. You stay out of my house, okay? Um, so yeah, we also need to light this up. So let's just put like... Uh, let's just put three down the middle, because otherwise we're going to be in major trouble, aren't we? Maybe, uh, yeah, that'll do. That'll do. It's a bit overkill, but hey, that's that's good for now. Um, we've got some on the sides, actually, so it should be okay, but I'll keep those there. Let's just put two in there instead. Um, there we go. So, and we can also see, like, all around everywhere, and it just looks absolutely incredible from up here. It really does. I love it. I love it. There's a cow over there. I must kill it. Can I get it from here? Oh, can I get it from here? Um, where's my bow? I had one a minute ago. I've got 17 arrows. Can I kill this cow? From here. Yeah. Oh, that, that was close. I think that was close, you know. Uh, let's go. Oh, that was way too far. Okay. I can do this. I can do this. Oh, that was so close. Go again. Yes! Oh my goodness, that was a shot. I know he's moving really fast and I'm not going to be able to shoot him. But anyway, <laughs> I also found an emerald from one of them pots, which is amazing. Actually, it might have been from the grass. So, welcome to the new house. What do you think? What should I add? What should I change? Because I know I use bricks for everything. The amount of bricks and clay this took, I've literally drained the whole world of clay. Not even joking. I had to travel far and wide to find it. Lots of coal was used and it was insane. Absolutely insane. We've got our fireplace here, which I need to finish off over there. So yeah, welcome to the new house. I hope that you are going to enjoy it. Um, I think we've got our little farm out here. I need to make a better one. Um, I can't remember what I was going to do today now that I've explained all of it. Um, what was I going to do? Oh my goodness, I've completely forgotten. Completely forgotten. We got, oh no, I just crushed that. Oh, good job. Good job, man. Good job. Where's my hoe? There we go. Um, let's grab this and plant them down because I just crushed it. Why would I do such a thing? What an idiot. And I haven't made that flat yet. I know I need to do that. So, what we need to do today is probably continue a little bit of the house. I'm liking it though. I thought I was going to be able to use like lots of wood, but then I didn't use the carpenter slopes. But um, if you can imagine this coming out all the way to about here so far, I might add a swimming pool to it because that's just the way I roll in Minecraft, okay? Um, I'm going to add a swimming pool because I just think I should... Um, oh, there's some poppies over here. I might grab these just to finish the outside. Oh, that was what I was going to do. I remembered what I was going to do. I need some uh, cobblestone for it though. So one, two... And um, we should be able to plant these, right? I think we should be able to plant these straight up. Um, yeah, we can. Awesome. So we don't need any um, plant pots or anything. The only bit that's worrying me... Well, it's not really worrying me anymore because I put torches in, but that was a bit strange when they kind of just attacked. Um, they put that there and there, and we're done. Um, I'm just going to throw you away, Mr. Dandelion. I'm sorry. Get out of here. <laughs> Burned it. So last time we lost two diamonds because I died twice, which was absolutely awful. Um, and I need to grab me some cobbly stone. So I've got nothing in here. Completely forgot about that. There's lots of storage space, which I like. Should be able to layer up some chests and stuff and make some larger chests. Uh, cobblestone. I need to make um, some of this. So we've got cobblestone path. You can get out of here because I don't need you. And yeah, we're going to make some cobblestone path out the front of the house. Where am I going? Um... It looks really nice, but look at this. Look, ah, oh, that looks so good. That looks so good. Yes. Um, we kind of need some more. Yeah, I've got a shovel here. Just going to grab some more dirt. Just so I can make a little bit more of a front garden. So I wanted to show you guys a little bit of the building process. Because we did a lot in the last episode, but I wanted to show you um, some of it. I didn't record all of it because it was a long time. It was a long time building. Um, so I didn't record all of it, obviously. Right then, let's grab this dirt. And start building up the front garden. Because it needs a little bit more frontage on it. Here we go. Along here. Just along this part. Along this part. And just along here. Nice one. And there we go. There is our little bit of garden now. We, I think we've got some cool fences that we can use. Let's have a quick look. We've got white fence. We've got electric fence. Oh, geez. That's dangerous. I'm not going to use that. So we need one piece of fence and one piece of bone meal. Have we got any fences? I don't think we have. Um, should we try that? Let's see what that looks like. Let's grab, um, what was it? Bone meal and fence. I think we used all our bone meal just now. So some of this in here. Uh, sticks. We can grab some sticks. So we can just make some fences real quick. Um, I can put this TNT away. Ah, oh, we've run out of space already? Already? Already run out of space. Jeez. 
This is crazy. Um, so we also need some bones. Okay, we got some nice. Um, I'm not gonna make them all into it just in case I need them for something else. Get those bones out of here, and then we can make some white fence. All right then, plop that in there. Bone mill in there. Four pieces of white fence. Ah, uh, yeah, and we need to decide what we want to make the door out of. Do you think I should keep it the same? I kind of pushed the door back a little bit. Um, I'm not sure why I used birch wood on the floor, but hey, that's what I did. That's what I did. Um, okay, this is interesting. We're going to need a lot of these, though. Definitely. Definitely got to use that. That looks so good. That really does. And then we can use some flowers along here. Ah, oh, it's going to be the perfect pretty little house. I hope so, anyway. I hope so, but we're going to need to make some more fences and then decide what else to do. I'll be back in a sec. Right then, I've got 20 white fence in total. That should definitely be enough. I maybe even made way too much. Uh, yeah, definitely. Definitely weighed way too much there, but we've got our nice little garden. Should I make it go this way as well, just to kind of round it off? Um, what does that look like? Um, I don't need this part. Give me this. Give me this. Um, oh, it's getting into night time as well. We need to light this up a little bit. Let's put that there and that there for now. Go away. Go away. You're always spawning in here. You've got a creeper face. I didn't even notice that before. Did not even know. Right, then let's go and have a quick nap. And then we should be able to build safely in the next episode. Next episode in the next day. I don't even know what I'm talking about today, guys. I've just been doing so much building. And my brain has literally melted. Um, I didn't think that could happen. I think we need to grab some more dirt, actually. Make this look a little bit more natural because I've kind of squared it off by accident. Um, oh! Oh, oh, oh. No, you don't want to do that. You don't want to do that. You don't want to do that. You don't want to do this. Go away and... Oh, backstab. Oh, backstab. There we go. Boom. Get out of here. This sword is incredible. And I'm so glad they're pretty easy to make as well. So I can just get more and more of them. And let's chop down this side. Uh, make it look natural so we don't destroy the beautiful environment that is Minecraft. Um, are we picking it up? We are here. 25. That's not bad. And, um, I thought that was something burning, but it's just my um, just my beautiful fireplace. Make it more out here. And then, boom, out here as well. And then we need to make it a little, a little bit more natural. Do we need a pickaxe for this? Yeah, that's better. Give me this. Um... Put the stone path here. We might need a little bit more stone path, but it's so cheap. It's literally two cobblestone for, was it eight pieces? It's so good. And that should be enough. There we go. Um, what we could do, oh, this is a perfect example. Um, where did I put those triangles? Slopes. Triangles? What am I on about? No. No, we need slopes. Um, this is going to be the perfect place to be able to use this, actually. So what we do, or what we can do, is do this. Oh! Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away, Cyclops. No, you and your friends need to back off. Your friends. You've got more than one. Good job. I mean, more than oh, there's loads. <laughs> go away, please. I'm going to stab you right in the face. Go away. Go away. We don't need this today. Uh, have I got any more steak? I don't. I have chicken, though. I should probably go and cook that. But for now, let's worry about these, shall we? I didn't mean to do that. I've still got axes, which is good. Um, and really efficient ones as well. And we put that there, that there, that there, that there. And then around this corner, we can go kind of, I think we can do this. And then we have to plan it a little bit. There we go. Um, and then another bit here. Yeah, that perfectly connects up. And then we do the same here. And then we just plop one random piece of dirt in there. And then what we need to do is, I've got an axe with silk touch, I think. Um, yeah, there we go. So if we grab some grass blocks... It's a little bit weird. It's going to take some time, but it does pick up the grass blocks for us rather than having to use an enchanter pickaxe. I'm pretty sure I got this from some random infernal mob. So let's just grab this. Oh, no, wait, wait. It might be... Hmm. It might be... I can't remember which um, which combination it is to give it... Oh, that kind of works anyway. Nice. Look at this. And there you go. We've got like a slope leading up to our house that you can actually walk up. It's so good. It's literally so good. And we can have like a little sloped garden right then. Let's put some in here. Also used a lot of lava for um, cooking all these bricks because there was so much and I didn't have that much coal. What I did is I just grabbed loads of, um, where's that axe gone? 
Did it break? No, it didn't. It didn't. It didn't. Awesome. Uh, yeah, I just grabbed loads of lava because it saved loads of time and lots of coal as well, more importantly. But um, how much of this are we going to need? Um, oh, I need to show you that massive hole that that guy made as well. Am I using the wrong one? Oh, what's wrong with me? Um, I'll keep that just in case. This is the Silk Touch one. I'll show you that massive hole that, that guy made. And he was some serious business. He was not messing around at all. He was just throwing TNT everywhere. And it was... It was a pain to deal with because I think he had, if I remember correctly, a hundred health. Which is a lot if the guy is flinging TNT at me. And you'll see how powerful the TNT was as well. Let me just grab this and go and fill up our carpenter's slopes. And yeah, this is looking really professional. Look at this. Um, do we have enough? Do we have enough? We might be a little bit short. Uh, uh, oh, we made it. We made it. We made it, guys. Are you proud of us? These tree ants, man. These tree ants just need to go away. Come here. Don't. It, it was them. It was them that were making that noise. You guys are crazy. Jeez. Jeez, jeez, jeez. But we made it. We made it. We're alive. And we got some awesome slopes to show for it. So basically, we can now, like, carve the landscape. Make epic hills. Whatever you really want with this Carpenter's Blocks mod. And that is why I have got it in this mod pack. It's awesome. Right then. I need to grab my little chickeny snack here. Uh, if I can find where I put it. I'm going to also put some of this away as well. Uh, grab this. My inventory is always full of nonsense. And I'm just going to show you where this guy literally exploded my life. Um, it's... Uh, close this. It was round here somewhere. Literally, what was it around here? We could do this to all, like, the slopes as well. It would take a lot of wood. Uh, it wasn't here. Was it round here somewhere? Where is it? You'll notice it when it... Oh, good, Cyclops is... Go away, go away, go away. Um, yeah, there's someone round here. Definitely round here. Hello, big big giant hole that I can't find. Where are you? Where are you? It might even be... Oh, you can go away. Oh, here it is, look. This used to be flat. But no, this guy decided... No, I don't want it to be flat. I want it to be completely exploded and a huge hole in the ground. Check it out. It's incredible. I think I might take a little trip down there, actually. Oh! I fell anyway. Um, that's fine. Let's take a trip down here for the rest of the episode, because we've done our building. And then next time, what I want to do is venture more into one of the different um, dimensions. Because I went into one last time, died twice, but I didn't use my... Um, I didn't use my wither chest plate, which I think would have allowed me to be saved a little bit more. The only issue is I don't really have a way to get across there... If, um, yeah, I don't have a way to get across, especially in the Haven dimension, if I don't have any way to uh, fly over, because the portal is literally in the sky, which is annoying. Oh, I just had a very scary beast as well. Also, I've lost one of my, um, one of my diamond pickaxe because I mined so much of the, uh, the, the bricks when I was building, so I've only got one now. But it's it's full. It's got 1,500 uses left, so I think we're good for that. And this guy actually helped us out a lot because he's got all this open. And he's, like, revealed ores. He's revealed all this cool cave stuff as well. Get out of here, you punk. <laughs> Proper hurt himself when he fell down, the silly, silly Billy. Um, oh, look at all these pots. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. A ghost. 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 Please go away, ghost. <laughs> I hate those. Oh, more emeralds. Thank you so much. The emeralds are amazing. I can do loads of trades with villagers. I should probably do that. Look at these emeralds. Oh, man. I just gained so many emeralds. I just gained five, em five emeralds in, like, a couple of slashes. That was incredible. Nice. And this is going to be a dead end. Fantastic. Um, it doesn't look like this opens up any kind of cave system, really. It might just be... Let me just collect some of this. Sorry, guys, the boring stuff must be done to survive here. Um, let me just put these emeralds away. There we go. Nice. Uh, we've only got one chicken left as well. So next time, I think we should get a little farming area set up. Um, I want to put some carpets in the main house uh, because the bricks just way too much. And it's going to get cold in the winter and stuff. So on your feet, imagine just walking on straight bricks. It's not good. You just have to wear shoes all the time, which isn't, which isn't that not ideal, is it, really? Another question is, how are we going to get out of here? I might have to switch my jetpack quickly. Um, we need a new helmet as well. If we could get... Actually, if we could get enough for the wither helmet, 
we'll have a full set and we'll be immune to wither. Not sure how much that's going to help, but it might help at least some bit. So the plan is I need to make a little back garden. So it's probably good that we've got some of this fence still. I want to make a back garden that kind of goes from here all the way out. And then we make a little farm, maybe a little animal farm as well, because we're going to need some wolves and building. And then, so I'll do like, I'll plan out the area for next episode, and then we'll go off exploring into the new dimensions and see if we can find any bosses. I really want to go for that haven boss, because we got it before in our grasp, and then just left it there, because I was confused about what was going on, and it wasn't working properly. Did I just, oh, what is wrong with me? I keep smashing up all these, this is why I need a farm, a farm area, and I love these fences too. So I need to grab some more wood in preparation for that. Let's grab some of that now while I outro the video. So thank you so much for watching guys. If you have any suggestions for the house, like what you'd like to see inside and stuff, cause I do have the furniture mod installed so that we can go ahead and make whatever we like and just pimp it out and make it look incredible. And oh, no, why are, you in, why are you interfering? So yeah, I hope you enjoyed watching this episode. If you did, please do leave a big fat thumbs up. And again, leave your suggestions for what you would like to see in the house and with the farm out the back. Um, I hope you like it. It's a little bit different to what I normally do. I'm not the best at building, but hey, I'm going to use micro blocks on it a little bit as well to make it look a little bit more fancy. But I hope you enjoy. And if you did, a big thumbs up would be awesome. And also, if you want to carry on keeping up with the Diamond Dimensions at Season 3 and also any other gameplay videos, then please do consider subscribing for daily gameplay videos. And I will see you in the next episode. Get out of here, Trients. I'm, I'm sick of you. Oh, 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 oh. No, that's bad. That's bad. How did he fling me so high in the sky? See you later, guys. I almost died. Oh, geez, I'm going home. Bye!